Hello everyone and welcome back to Divide and Conquer. We're now on part 14 of our Reunited Kingdom campaign. Has been some time, so apologies for that. Let's have a brief recap. Kirin yes. is on his way to Galibrin with a full stack. Um, full stack of trash, might I add, but nevertheless yes, he should be able to take that. Then he can move on the Black Gate, hopefully. Your orders, my lord. Bregvan is aging. Um, the Forbidden Pool, is it? Are the army in here, led by Leofric the Board. Once he's taken care of them, he will then also march up to the Black Gate. And those two hopefully can hold it. Yes, we have four long crossing the bridge with a somewhat decent army. A few uh, improved units, shall we say, in that army. That's going to reinforce um, the main army led by Aragorn. Who is slowly pushing into Mordor. He's also spotted by King of the Dead. So once we've taken this little fort, we'll then send King of the Dead straight to Baradur. And he can take out that. I'm not sure what we're going to do with the other two battles after. Um, but I think we just take it out for now. That gets rid of the Nazgul's respawning. And we'll see how we're faring. Well, it gets a bit buggy over there. Yes, my lord. And then we also have Denethor with Tulin marching south to take back Ostathil. Um, it has a pitiful Mordor garrison. And hopefully we're going to go further south and take Houthanur back as well, hopefully. As long as the Varags don't get there first. We are allied to the Varags. They are luckily pulling all of their forces back, so we don't need to worry about them. Or the Ardenaim or Harad for the time being. The Varag should be able to keep them busy. We did also manage to fill all of the forts with um, quite a lot of units. And some decent units as well. So should any Ardenaim or Harad forces rear their ugly heads. Uh, we should be able to react swiftly. And we do also have Admiral Bimeldia. We have a few ships to move units around if we need to. Further to the west, again we just got more forts filled up. It looks like we may lose Balon next turn, as it is only on 50% public order. We do have some units trying to reinforce it, but I don't think we'll get there in time. So we'll see what happens. If it rebels, then we'll just retake it, hopefully. And Eluin is coming back north to take this sorry state of an army a lot of these units need replenishing um he's gonna lead them up north northeast and hopefully take Ind, Und, however you pronounce it and then we may sell that to Rohan or Enelweith or actually no we were gonna go what we want to do actually is take Isengard don't we it's a bit annoying that the Rohirrim have actually crossed the River Eisen and taken this settlement. Because we were hoping we could capture all this. Because eventually we want to merge. We don't have a break, basically, in our territory. So if we could take the rest of Isengard's provinces, then march in at Dunland, then we move up. Then we have all of our settlements are linked then somewhere. We have a path directly through all of our territory. Yes, my lord. That is the plan, anyway. How well that goes remains to be seen. By your command. Let's pull out all the units that need replenishing. And we'll send them back. Get replenished. Then the rest can just stay put for now. Yes, my lord. And I think that's everything in the south. I don't think we've got anything else going on just yet. Nope. And then in the far north. Your orders, my lord. Albarad. No he's building some watchtowers. Oh, Willishar. Is that going to rebel? 5%. It should be okay because we're going to build a meeting hall. Fine. Yeah, Halbarad's going to make his way back east. Take control of the garrison at Tharbad. The 
more units are moving down to Tharbad as well to reinforce. That's fine. So we should be at whole Tharbad against Dunland. Um, forever and a day now. Wouldn't really be an issue. The High Elves are sort of holding out against the Goblins. But they're also now having to contend with Angmar, which is good. Hoping that they'd push out into the Rude Owl plans and take that settlement. But I don't think they're going to. Angmar still hasn't taken uh, a Numenas, is that? Or is that Fornos de Rain? I can't remember. Or is that the same thing? I can't remember. There's a settlement here. And it's still um, Rebel Held, which is interesting. Right, anyway, I don't think there's much else we can do yes. now. So let's just end then. And we are also, I forgot to say, we're losing about 10,000 a turn still. So we should be okay for the next couple of turns. Hopefully by then we'll have taken some more settlements. And probably lost some more units. That'll balance out. Oh. Are they just, yeah, they're just trying to bribe. Denethor has been presented with a bride. Except Royal Rangers Guild. Terralond. I would want to build that normally. Uh, Balorn. Oh, we do still hold it. That's interesting. Recruitment. We've built the war camps in a lot of places. That's good. Because that is our main recruitment building. We're wanting everything now apart from financials, which is awkward of going about actually. And the Anduin Vale has been destroyed. It looks like it's just been crushed by a combination of Gundabad, Dolgado, and the goblins. Oh, you scum. You scumbags. Never mind. Right, let's pull him back. Who can we retrain? Nobody. Fantastic. Need to build the war camp first. That'll be one more turn. That's fine. Right, we're now only losing 8,000 a turn. You fix the issue? You don't. How does not put in three full units in them? Right, we get the meeting hall next turn. We'll add 5%. Not a lot. Granted, but better than nothing. So we'll see what that's like when it's built next turn. Uh, guild house we will get. Might as well. I don't think there's much else we can do. Well, these guys can just sit here for now. They are burning a bit of money. But they are also saving a lot. These four units being in each. Even quite a bit. Yes. Duin here needs to go in this fort over here. here. Save us a bit more money. Your orders, my oh, and Orad Oradreth is here as well. Completely forgot about Oradreth. And the Orthon. So we have another army coming up. <laughs> to reinforce. You have yes. quite a lot of yes, units. Uh, once you reunite the kingdoms, that's for sure. Right, Denethor. Siege Ostithil for me. We've yes. only got one unit as a garrison, so... Yes, my Lord. be we fine with the siege, sir. Yes. Get that next turn. No point messing about. Your orders, my Lord. Yes, my Lord. Uh, do do do, Hurin. And besiege Gelebrin next turn as well. Pull you back to the Black Gate. As you wish. I can't see any more forces just yet. A few more turns for these forts before they sally out or either just get killed. Yes, my lord. Either one is fine with me. Right until we get the Minas Ithil Guardians. 15 turns, not too long. Yes. Got the King of the Dead waiting. Your orders, my lord. Yeah, I don't want to put him in because then I'll use up a battle. Yes, my lord. We could put four along behind him. Can he get in there? Yes, yes he can. I'll do. 
Reinforce. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Probably shift some of these units out, I think. What's that like if we move these out? As you wish. Merging armies. 65%. Does hate us. Orders, my lord. Who can we get rid of? Guardsmen. Yes. That'll do. And if we take these guys out. Yeah. Send you back. Yes. The trouble is now though, we can't really retrain them. Are they Gondor archers and glass pipe? You can get retrained here actually. Um, Arthur Day Knights as well, we can get in Western Azkili if that's what we've got. We can also get some Athelium Rangers. God, there's so many cool units we could get. Just, we are hemorrhaging money right now. Right. And for us, you as jump you back wish. in there, you might as well send the archers back with yeah. you as well. And you've retrained them for me. You also have a unit of Fountain Guard just sat there, not doing much. You need to get them involved at some point. Oh, Peasant Militia. Best unit in the game. Right, two units left for them. Yes, Here's a turn away from attacking Gelebrin. We'll take Ossithil next turn. I think that's everything for now. Uh, actually, we need to send Eluin out, don't we? This so as you can build some towers for lands. me. Yes. That's what we wanted to do. This tower oh, we lose that cell, <laughs> ideally. Yes, my lord. And Halbarad, lord, you're the same. Yes, we can go no further, my lord. This tower will keep vigil over the land. Yes, my lord. Probably take my while to go through and dot the towers around, but Halbarad has a, a pretty decent garrison. I wouldn't say a really good garrison because <laughs> it's just ranged units, really. And um, with a couple of Dunedain Wardens and Bree Militia. But it's not the strongest by any means. When we build the barracks, what do we get access to? Dunedain and Cardlin, you basically. But yeah, once we've, we get access to that, we should be fine. We need two more turns. And then we can build order, decent building. Um, an Angrim army has just popped up out of nowhere. Quite a sizable one at that as well. It will be and we also have Brand that's come down you. from the north. So let's pull these we'll guys back into our soul. We do what else? Do we? Might as well build a herbalist, I suppose. I'll help with both. Yes, my lord. Be gone. Right, so this is the annoying thing now. So there, Captain Ninian. Come and get me. Probably not going to attack Fenestrunen. If he does, I think we'd be fine. They take two turns anyway, so that's point. Get the Lumberman instead. But I've got a funny feeling that they're just going to go for Tithuan instead. And obviously we have Gandalf there as well, which this is the one we don't want to. So we would like to keep Gandalf alive. Trouble is, where do we send him? Yes, my lord. We were going to put him in Tharbad, and then Halbrad and Gandalf could march into um, Dunland and take them. But... Your orders, my lord. Do we stick me in Fenris Druunin for now? We can't sneak these units under the bridge, unfortunately. He's going to be pretty useless in a siege defense. Your orders, my lord. Oof, what do yes, we do? He can move far as well. Holy hell. Your orders, my lord. Right, us all should be fine from even both of those with Overgill. And um, we do also have the um, barracks, not the barracks, the Garpost, whatever it's called, that gives you units on the defense i think fenestrian has that as well the militia garrison yes so we get two extra units yes my lord do we put gandalf in there as well no. your orders my lord we don't we carry on Honor. yes Take you in thabad 
recruit as many men as you can. Get a unit of them, they're crap, but hey ho. Don't know, it's pointless recruiting anything there, so. We'll see. Hopefully we can tempt them into attacking Fenestruna. That would be more beneficial for us. And what was I doing with my without question? Oh, I'm not sure. Right, I think that'll do. Let's see what the forces of Angmar do. And Edwise is pushing on Isengard. I forgot about Edwise to be honest. I was quite concerned with Rohan taking them out. And I completely forgot about Edwise. They'll probably get to them before we do. Okay, they attack Fenestrin. That's fine. The enemy lays siege to our people. We should be okay with that. Oh, wow, they took our forts. How oh, dare they? Glad I'm trying to bribe us again. Yes. That was me thinking you might want people. Got assess. A ranger's guild. Why not? I'm not going to have money much longer to do anything else. It's still only at 50%. Why is it only at 50 Castle, and it's got meat so That gives 10%. Four units in there. Right, well, I think that's going to rebel. Fenestrun, and you can hold that for four turns. Hopefully, they will attack us in the next turn. So, we should be okay there. Um, we'll see what these guys do. Again, hopefully, they attack us as well. Fine. 1500. Uh, yeah, just build it. Fine. Yes, my lord. Right, Your Gandalf, orders, my lord. You can move so far. With honor. You may as well plunk some watchtowers down for us. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. As this is this the last turn that we're going to have any lands. money. Yes, my lord. Um, With honor. This tower will keep which is quite annoying. I hate not being able to put watchtowers lord, down. My lord. Right, now we've got Gandalf over here. Tomorrow. Let's send Halbred back to Tharbad. He can lead the force we there. We don't want to keep Gandalf in the settlement, really, because yes, his lord. movement is crazy ridiculous right now. Um, yes, and if he just sits in a settlement for a while, he'll lose I think it's 15% movement. But we don't want that. Right, yes, Denethor. Ostathil. What have you got? Nazcuga. Got a unit of Uruk bodyguards. Must right, let's fight some. We, we do want to lose men, but I'd, we may as well just fight some. <laughs> Otherwise, the game just could be ridiculous and we could lose like a thousand men. Because it is a castle. Let's just send in the chaff. Yeah, I should. Probably run away, I think. Or retreat to the... And the town square. What do they do? Oh, you've got Dunedain bodyguards. What are you doing? Right, they are retreating, so... Send these guys in. We'll just send in the... Rash. All the units that don't have many in, and Denethor as well. That should be enough to kill these holy orcs. The battering ram is in place. It'll not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Come on, quicker. Our men have done well. You've done very well. Well done, man. Very proud. Right, get stuck in. We've got the Lamadan clansmen as well, which are armor piercing, so they should be. And of course, we've got Denethor himself, with his amazingly defensive captain's bodyguard. 
tactic. Zigzag. The old Gondorian zigzag tactic. Get you guys up there. I expect these guys to die, but they don't have a lord. Right. Try and charge the side with the general as if you can. You guys charge from this side. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Any thought? Off a chant. Beautiful. General's already dead. And then we'll get Denethor to finish him off from the rear. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have Perfect encirclement. If we continue yeah. like this, we will bodyguards, the they're not really that good. This is a clear victory. Well done, Denethor. I love the Battle for Helm's Deep. Such a good scene. In the movies. Obviously it's quite different in the book. Still just as good. Right, Osterthil is now ours. Um, it looks like it's been held by the Orcs for a while. So we probably want to exterminate, I think. And then we'll just break everything. Apart from that, the orcs. So, like for money now, not too bad. Still losing a fair bit. Right, will it let us move on if we leave those behind? No, it will not. Fifty-five. Okay. Your orders, my lord. As you wish. Yes, my lord. By your. Your orders, my lord. Uh, what else? As you wish. All 55 still. Yes, really? Right, what about Tulin then? My lord. Yep. Yes, my lord. Your orders, my uh, do, do, do. Right, so you guys carry on. Ooh. Okay, never mind. Yes, my lord. Assembling a mighty host. And you guys can't join. Why can't you guys make it back? You literally left the same army. Yeah. Make much sense. Right, we do have another army down here then, Zagar. We need to defeat him. And it looks like Harad's already kicking stuff off with the Variags. They've managed to take um Harondo. Yeah, that's right. Yes, my Right, Denethor has to kill Zagar. And then take Kothanu. Hopefully he can manage that. Your orders, my well, I don't know, because his army is pretty crap. There's not a lot of good... Good units in there. What do we do? Counting Your guard, you might as well go lord. take that. Or for me. Ours. In there. Conquered, my lord. Yes, right, my lord. do we send Orodreth down there to support? In case things go badly? With honour. We can go no further, I don't think it's the worst thing ever. This tower will keep yes, my lord. We'll try anyway. We'll send Orodrith down. Yes. And build some more towers. We've got one more turn, then the forts are down as yes, well. You can now attack Gelebrin. Um, you do have three bear. ballistas, but I'm not confident that you can take the gates down. So, yes. 23 units in garrison. That shouldn't be an issue. So, we're sorted again in the east. In the west, we still have an issue with Balorn. Yes, my lord. Doing that. Um, trouble is, it's got the mines, which are really good, and that's probably helping quite a bit. Um, with our income. Your orders, my lord. Yes. Any trouble? This tower will keep vigil over the lands. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Let's see what happens next turn. I think it'll probably kick us out next turn. 
Yes, my lord. Alright, Gandalf, you've moved. Halbrad, you've lord, moved. That's lord. fine. And Edwyth, you still haven't taken Erin Vaughn yet. There's a sizable rebel army kicking around. Hopefully they don't attack us. Right, let's just see what Angmar do in the north. But I think that is it for now. So... Let's try to get rid of that. I'm going to get rid of that for now, actually, because then that'll give us a bit more money next turn. Hopefully. And then we can build some more towers. Everybody loves towers. Glory, honor, okay, so they didn't victory. even fight either of them, cowards. The so Leothric, the board, has just been crushed. So we have Captain Helaguni and Captain Ninium. Not so uh, they've got ballista, a lot of wag units, but other than that, a lot of trash really. The only thing I suppose is the Angmar and infantry, they're quite good, and the Rudar savages, but there's not many of those. The rest is pretty trash. Trash, 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 trash. So it'll be okay. We do have two units of orc um I was gonna say orc defenders there. Blasphemy. Two units of Dunedine. Volunteers, I think they call. That point, Dunedain volunteers, yes, and they're pretty good. So you guys can go there. Woodland hunters, you guys can go there. We do Dunedain. I always say Dunedain. 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 Dunedain rangers. Dunedain rangers. I say Dunedain rangers. I'm not sure. Right, I think is that all the archers set? Oh no, it's not. We forgot about the most important unit of them all. That has been absolutely garbage. Right. Freeland militia. New guys. Go here. That would be grand. No? Okay. And you guys go here. Maximum, you can just look in the middle somewhere. You guys go there. I think that's everyone. Yes. Right, let's start the battle. And then let's reform this side. Basically, you just don't want them getting up the sides. They can't get to the archers, really. I mean, um, Lumberman, you are not meant to go there. Bit of an angle like that, I'll do. And then all of them can go on the defensive. And then archers fire up. Oh, but we are going to have to wait until the blisters. Got all of its ammo. Fortunately. They just seem to be targeting one unit of Warden Hunters. And they haven't killed many, actually. I think that's partially because the Dunedain Rangers have just wasted half their ammunition on that one unit. So please stop firing. You are my best unit. Right, Lumberman, you have one mission. Take them out. Take that ballista crew out. Go, go, go. Beautiful. Right, Rangers start taking them pikemen out. Everyone else can fire at will. 
Lumbermen have already routed. Did you take out the ballista crew? I think they did. Well done, lads. They completed the mission. That's fine. we happy with that. I just didn't want to stand there and wait for 20 minutes while they fire 100 bolts. Um, I don't want you messing around near the gate, actually, so just get inside quickly. And then close the gate. There we go. I think we might leave them out in the front. Like, sort of cool, that stand, but... I think they'll just mess up the gate and the AI will probably just run through. So let's not do that. Ranger do target the infantry. That's probably their best unit. You guys shoot the archers. Is that it? You guys shoot those archers. The enemy are battering down the gates! Doing well. Killed nearly 30%, so. The enemy's bad. ram has breached the gates. Right, here they come. The walls are no longer Defensive ours. formation. The enemy have taken them. The battle is very much. Oh, it's gonna go really paper. buggy. Victory will be ours. Put it down a bit. Down a little bit. Yeah, they had quite a lot of wag units. Um and we have a lot of speed units, so we should be okay. And also charging through the gear like that, they're not gonna get much of a charge bonus. Right, let's take everyone off defensive and get stuck in. File in. Go, go, go. Archers are still firing. I'm sure you're killing many of our own troops. Oh, thank you for that. Well, we at 50%. We lost 10%. An absolute cluster of wads. Come on, you should be pushing them back. Is that there, General? I think it is. Captain Ninian. The enemy are right, it should bloody. start to waver and break now. The wavering. Couple of breaking. Is the mass route happening? Yes, it is. Right, charge them all at the gate. Kill them all. Charge out that gate. Run out, kill everyone. Kill them all. I probably shouldn't be doing this, to be honest. I should at least just send out the volunteers. There's no one going to be chasing these down to the end of the earth. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I thought they would I thought they would skirmish forever. But they didn't. Right, we should definitely be faster than these guys. Especially the lumbermen. They're really lightly armored. Come on. Catch those thralls. What we are, 82%. I don't oh, what are you doing? They just walk into them and bounce back. They're not made of rubber. Come on. Kill them all. Pack them down. Oh my god, stop doing that. You guys really don't know how to chase down fleeing units. What is going on? Just run over them. You haven't killed a single one. Wow. The enemy are well, that was disappointing. Vanquished. We this lost 305, but we killed 1,600. Uh, I'll try that again. Generals. We lost 305, and we killed 1,767. Who got the top kill? Wooden Hunters. 246. Which is surprising, actually. Well, I suppose the Dunedar Rangers wasted a lot of their ammunition on the Ballistic. Not bad at all. It's a shame that we couldn't run down more units at the end there. I don't really know what the lumbermen were doing. Fancy killing anyone after the battle.
Kill them all. Right, that was a sizable Angrim army there. Managed to defeat. So I hope we don't see another one for a while. At least until we can replenish the units that we lost. Imlak. We don't need hire another general. I believe that is the chap that plays Arathorn, Aragorn's father, in the... Oh, what was the film called? Well, I suppose, would you call it a film? I think it was a film. It was sort of like a fan-made... I think it was a fan-made movie about how Aragorn gets left in the woods and it's about his father and his and mother. Um, it was quite good, actually. I'm pretty sure that's the chap. Right, Brethel wants a horse bridges guild. You shall have one. The lawn is still rioting. And it's still at 50%. I have no idea why this has not kicked us out yet. And we are now only losing 2,000 a turn. Yes, Perfect. my lord. Just what I want. With honour, this tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yes. I'm built. With honour, we shall continue tomorrow. This tower will keep vigil over the land. So I probably should have put um, Eloin in there because he probably would have stabilised the public order, but I love towers more. We do have a small Isengard army coming for us though. So I think it's time we mobilise our troops. We don't really want Helluin to get cut off. So let's stick you guys together. That means we are going to start losing more money after we just are about to break even. So you guys target them. You guys can retrain everybody. Perfect. And get that cav as well. You might as well. Finish Gelling cav is very good. Gandalf. More towers, please. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. See what everyone else is up to. Yes, my lord. Oh my this god, Dunland took Londaire. The when the hell did they manage that? And they've taken Barovin as well. And uh, Heroth. So they've definitely pushed south. I think at one point, all they had was these three settlements. Because they've managed to push all the way down there. They're doing quite well. But it looks like Enobai is about to take it back. So. Your orders, my lord. Yes, my lord. Your orders, They're still my hanging lord. in there. Right, Halbrad, yes, you're moving back, aren't you? With honor, this look as a tower down on your way back, sir. Your you go back to Tharbad. Enobai, I'm not sure what they're doing, really, but they can just pot around if they want. Will, you guys are taking them. I think we're done on there. The east. Yes, my lord. Interesting, Zagar's just sat there. He didn't attack us, which I thought he might have. Your orders, my lord. So what we will do yes, my lord. Yes. This is we we'll wait for your orders, my lord. Our address. Yes, my lord. Actually, no, we won't. My lord. Yes, my lord. We can make a better orders, army, I think, actually. So next yes, turn we'll wait till our address um, able to move. And then we'll fine-tune Denethor's army a little bit. Yes, my lord. We'll take Eorthen as well, make a full stack, Your and then Denethor can go south. Take Zagar. Yes, and then whatever's left, we'll move Orodreth back up. And he can just sit in this fort or something for now. Yes. Finally taken this fort. Move. So that means we As can move command. the King of the Dead in. We shall slaughter them, my lord. Oh my god, it's so tempting to just kill the Witch King now. With one of the battles. Because we'd kill Shivu as well. And we'd take Urk Estelad. So easy with the King of the Dead. So tempting. We would just crush them. Alright, build a Dunedain war camp there for me. We need the public order, definitely. No fool, send your emissary to me. Uh, why are you mourning about public order? You're fine. Don't worry. Right, we've now got Bregvan and his army. Go on, let's do a little 
reorganization. And oh, we do have, well, one unit of Dol Amroth Squires in here, although they have been um, hit quite hard. But yeah, now we're back to losing around 7,000 per turn, <laughs> which is not good. Right, you can move to that gate for me. Doesn't look like anybody's coming to relieve Gellibrand. So we'll attack that next time. They're moving yes. there. Yes, my lord. Forlong. What do we do with Forlong? Your orders, my lord. Because we don't really want Boromir to get besieged there, do we? Yes, my lord. So let's chuck those units in with Aragon for now. Your orders, my lord. And you can take them and the clansmen so you've got a bit of cavalry you guys don't have much range though do you pick the archers in his body yes, right that'll do yes yeah we'll see what these guys do with the king of the dead first you guys are going south yep yeah, that seems like a good place to end this episode right so next time we'll pick the fight up uh Gellibrin. we'll take that then we can move these two armies east to take the Black Gate. Then when they've taken that, I think we'll wait until they've taken that. Then we'll move in with Forlong and Aragorn. King of the Dead can take Baradur. Then Thor and Aradreth can sort out the south. And then move back up to deal with Mordor. Then in the east, sorry, the west, we need uh, Herluin to take out Goon from Isengard. And then we just need to sort of keep batting back Angmar. But it has become a bit more tricky. I respect as we've sort of left enemy. Bran to go through now. I've missed that. We may take Tethuin. It'd be really annoying because we've built that up. And they're just going to smash it. To... But that is one for the next episode. So as always, I hope you guys enjoyed and I shall catch you all in the next one.